Blasters. Hello and welcome to this episode of No Blasters with me, Karen Bartlett. Today's guests are Dave Elliott and William Thompson, oh. heroes of the local comedy circuit and scene. I hate all those words anyway, yeah. apart from heroes. Anyway, uh, I'm also having a wee jocks or coffee right now and a wee Sally P. This is, look at this. This is where I was meant to be. Anyway, um, <laughs> I was born this way. Anyway, so uh, today's episode, uh, I want to start off by telling you about our Patreon over at patreon.com forward slash no blasters for just a few thruppence a month, three pound, um, <coughs> for three quid a month, you get an extra uh, no blasters every Thursday. It's called no blasters extra time. It's a good time. I just recorded a couple today. Got rinsed by Patreons playing me, so that was fucking devastating. Um, oh, don't even want to, don't even fucking start me. Anyway, uh, get over there. We also do uh, weekly updates, uh, twice weekly updates. In fact, um, we have all our specials go on there. The majestic special is on there. The last, never mind the mock blame. The new, never mind the mock blame, will be going on there. It's filled with content. We jack it out every... That sounds disgusting. We jack it up every week. Uh, noblasters.com forward slash... No. Fuck me. Patreon.com forward slash noblasters. Today's episode, also sponsored by the best company if you want to straight up strangulate pube growth. Manscaped.com. You want to you wanna get your pubes... And you want to fucking do an Alan Titchmarsh on them? A wee fucking, a wee, a wee ground force? Vroom. Fucking get in there with the lawnmower 4.0. Gets in them difficult to reach places. Doesn't snag the bag. Doesn't sin the skin. Doesn't, doesn't rip, doesn't rip your hip. There you go. All, all rhymes. Um, get over on to manscaped.com. Use the code NOBLASTERS20. That's the word, NOBLASTERS. All is one word and the number twenty two zero for twenty percent off and free shipping. Get yourself the performance package four point oh comes with that lawnmower four point oh comes with the weed whacker two point oh for your nose and ear her. All comes in a wee bag. You get all the other products, ball deodorant, ball wipes, everything. See the ball wipes? Perfect. On on a summer's day where you've been out for a dander and you come back and go, I don't really feel like I want a shower. But I also don't want to be carrying a fucking handful of mackerel down my monks. So you go in, it smells like your fucking grand is aftershave. It's a good time, all right? So get over to manscaped.com, use the code NOBLASTERS20. There are OG sponsors, we love them, they love us. It's all good. Guys, let's get into this episode properly now. Today is a big day, today is a big day. It's a big so day. that ad read, did you really just try and entice people by being like, do you want your balls to smell like your granddad? No, no, not your granddad. Your granda's aftershave. So does that you mean say your granda's aftershave smells like a mixture of manscaped and ball sweat? It's a, no. My, my granda's, and I was, uh, thanks for bringing this up, guys, because I was born without granda's, but anyway. Nice. Um, I'm trying to say that. Um, <laughs> it's like a Channel 4 document. I know, yeah. yeah. The it, man do, without granda's. Do you, know, do you know what it is? This is, this is, my, this is my X Factor Solve story. <laughs> do this for you, granddad. <laughs> um, <laughs> I was right. Rodney Trotter. Thank you. you. Um, <laughs> basically, uh, no, I mean it's good. One of them, one of them died young, and the other one died after a drunk driver smashed on them. So thanks oh, for bringing yeah, that up, gosh, guys. Speaking of which, so beers for the boys. Oh, sure. So, so um, <laughs> two cons. <laughs> yeah, uh, your is feeling a bit rock sore after. So, you um, <laughs> smite him, Granda. <laughs> smite him. Anyway. So we, uh, what were we all about? No, so it doesn't smell like your granda. I'm saying, it, do you know what it is? You've both used Manscaped, haven't you? Yeah, 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 yeah. It smells like an old school manly smell. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what? This is what, I mean, listen, big respect to Manscaped. The f- smell of the ball deodorant is delicious. The smell I of the wipes it. are delicious. But then why didn't they put that fragrance into the actual spray? Why does the spray smell different? What's what spray? On? The ball toner? No, they had a sp- an actual aftershave. Oh, I think right, they okay. they that now. But they need to go back into the lab and make it. It should be the, the same balls. smell. Yeah. Well, the smell of the wipes and the smell of ball deodorant, I like. Mm. You know, the ball <laughs> deodorant. I, I'll be honest with you, I've been trying something new for the last week and a half. No ball deodorant. Terrible. Yeah. I'm going back to it ball literally tomorrow. It, it is, why why'd you stop? I stopped because, right, so I had a wee day. Do you want to <laughs> get into this? <Yeah. laughs> I had a wee day where 
I had a, I, did, you ever, did you ever get big bag? Yeah. I had big bag and I was sort of going. What? What and is? I was in the car. What do you mean by big bag? Because I get a long stretchy bag. Right. Well, I I get both. There, there's right. I'll tell you. Uh, same you, being honest. Big bags needed. Same honest. Bags. There's if you were in a guy Richie film, you'd be called big bag. There's three. <laughs> there's three different oh, things that I get. Cancer. There's three different things that big I get. Bag so. Bartley. <laughs> Big bag part. Look, there's, there's three different things that I get. One, one is big bag. Two is large bag, which is not good. No. And then, and then I, I get long bag. Yeah. Long bag to me. If you imagine that is my bag, right? Yeah. Long bag starts down there and stretches uh-huh. back to the asshole. Right. Mm. I feel, I feel like those. That's the bit that's stretched out. Long bag for me is really like eat five bits of chew and go, and then you just go. And it just swings and then, it catches everywhere. It gets between aye, the but legs, that, closes, but that, but that stretch the seats. to me, that stretch starts here, like behind the bag, uh-huh. and stretches down. See, I don't, yeah. I don't get this. Big bag it just happens. A big bag, bag is like everything. A coin purse. Big You're bag. Like a dog your ball sacks up your tummy. <laughs> yeah. Big bag is everything. Feels like just a bit bigger. You like and it's a bit, it. it's a wee bit like this. Right, you need a bus and then, then, and then large bag oh. is if you if you're having a big bag day uh-huh. and you have to go do stuff, you're getting large bag, oh, so which what, is this. What do you mean do stuff like beat off? No, like you have to go do right. stuff. Like you have to go like the, ch- the on shops. a dander, or you have to go like sit in the car for ages. Do you ever sit in the Hold car on. for ages? Are they the two things you have to do all day? <laughs> go for a dander and sit in the car. Why yeah. What about real? I, I don't have <laughs> children. Do this is a great time. <laughs> um, but like, anyway, I've been in this house too long. We'll sit in the car. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Bring me a nice bag. <laughs> gotta go sit in the car. It's outside. Uh, no, it's like I when I when I get big bag or whatever the so I I had a day where I had big bag and I went is that am I getting big bag? I had sort of two days in a row. I went am I getting big bag because I'm putting on the deodorant and maybe not letting it dry all the way before I pull the monks up. Mm. See in Jay Z terms, can you do like how how big is the the bag we're talking it, for. Mate, well, what's your, do you know what, like do you know what it is? Do you ever get do you ever get like a do you ever get like a, a cut or something in your mouth uh, or in your ear? Here's mm-hmm. it right. Do you ever get a cut or something in your ear? Uh, or like a spot in your ear? You know, uh, like see, I get one like right a, here. Okay. Known known as a shill corn among millies in Belfast. Anyway, if you ever get one of those, I know I'm being serious. Shell that's it. That, this is like that's a shell corn. That's an old. Belfast work. If you told me I was like a Millie's child's name, I'd be uh-huh. <laughs> Shellcorn! Yeah. You're a want Shellcorn Smith, get back in this car now. Shellcorn sounds like a, like a solicitor of a Smith family. You need to go fuck and see Shellcorn. <laughs> it <laughs> sounds like again, you bastard. It sounds like a band you'd wear their merch. It also, and then get annoyed. I don't know. It, so, it sounds like it sounds it sounds like a band. <laughs> it sounds like a band that you can't read. Shell band corn. them. Yeah, it's like that. Yeah, yeah. And, um, like, what the fuck do you mean? Shellcorn are doing limelight like too. I'm like, who's <laughs> Shellcorn? <laughs> Shellcorn. <laughs> behind the ear album. Fuck you. Um, behind the ear album. Yeah. Did you say? Oh my god. The rape your puppies album. Yeah. By yeah. Shell <laughs> <laughs> so like so like do you ever get one of those and when you touch it it feels massive yeah or if mm-hmm. you get a cut in your mouth or something or you have a mouth ulcer yeah and you run your tongue over it it feels huge mm-hmm. my, my my bag is probably not that much bigger when you run your tongue I'm over it's it bigger, it's, it's, big, it's bigger than an ulcer <laughs> yeah but I'm saying sorry sorry what was that L.O. Cook J do that again oh yeah mm-hmm. Alice L.O. Cook J does that all the time I know you're independent. You can make it on your own. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, and then whenever he forgets lyrics, he goes, zzz, 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 zzz. Mm. Like, what's he doing? <laughs> Do you remember that song he did, though, with J-Lo? At, yeah. uh, it's uh, hard to control myself. Mm. <laughs> her, lyric, her lyrics in that are meant, although they, um, I hate that bit where <laughs> she says, like, um, my, was it my time, my love is all I have or something? Oh, that's time, another one. She has two time with them. Is all I have. Time is what you want, baby girl. I'm what you have. Yeah. Uh, well, there's another one where he's very predatory when he does a song with her. He's like, I'm trying to control myself, uh, but I can continue to pop it. I know you don't want it, but I keep going, bitch. Jesus. And you're like, LL, relax yourself. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He loves here. Hey, it's, listen, he's not R. Kelly. Let's ladies go. love him. Like, sure. Do you know that's what that means? Yeah, yeah. Ladies, ladies love, love cool, yeah. You know what the thing about that is? Don't be called cool James ever. Is is um. Cool James. Is 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 I mean, Ja Rule? Is this true that Ja Rule is supposed to mean real unconditional love exists? Is that true? I heard that years ago. No, I just think it's something to do with the Nazis. Yes, Rule or something. Some sort of like the Final Solution Mark Two. <laughs> ja Rule. <laughs> so I thought it was yeah. Jamaican, like Ja. No, it's like ja ja Rule. I thought it was. I thought it was like a mix of Rasta, but I heard that the Rule stands for 
real unconditional yeah. love exists. I think yeah. it means uh, I'm stunk in 2003. Please help me out. Oh my God. Do you remember? But do you remember? Do you remember how I'm good such he was? a big Eminem fan that he had beef with Jaru. I'll never forget him. Do you remember how? Remember it was him and Ashanti were everywhere for like about. Six months. I was on fucking your hips, your thighs. Yeah. I never when I meet you, babe. That's how fucking great. What was her big her? song? She had Ashanti. a what's love? Was that it? Or she had one got in the summertime. Do, got to do she, with it. She's one in the summertime where she was like in a wee summer dress, going like. She has a real banger that I just can't think of. Aaliyah. Aaliyah, sorry. No, she died and after she married Dark Kelly. Coincidence? <laughs> Well, when he was her manager and kind of made him marry her. <laughs> Not really a coincidence, more just absolute crap. She was in the Jet Li movie, Romeo Must Die. Do you remember that? No. Yeah. No. Oh, that's that was right. That was... And then Try Again. <clears throat> what a banger that was, Aaliyah. So. Dust yourself off for Try Again. Yeah. You could you could do for Try Again. You know who doesn't get enough credit that's as one of the best producers ever? Timbaland. Timbaland. Oh, oh. oh. I like bang, when, bang, I like bang. I like when it see this is the level of uh, music like pop music and stuff R&B that I can talk about because it was 20 years ago yeah, yes. when I still cared see today when Matil- I still cared. Matilda and I go cruising about sometimes after Rhythm and Rhyme we have Jay-Z or so like we just get in the car she likes the music sounds of- like you do that I'm Matilda's <laughs> yeah. listening she likes the blueprint she likes original Jigga you know what I'm saying <laughs> And like especially yesterday, Catherine showed me a TikTok, and I, 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 I was as angry as you were. I was furious because she was like, "Look at this!" And Jay Z was walking into Beyonce concert, and some kid had videoed him walking in. And you know, she wrote, "Blue Ivy's daddy's arrived at the venue." I was like, "It's not Blue Ivy. It's the Jigga man. What are you doing? It's Jay fucking Z." <sighs> Blue Ivy's daddy. But Matilda's throwing it up in the back seat, you know, enjoying the Jigga. <laughs> you know. So speak, speaking of this. Imagine that's my bag. <laughs> on, on on big bag day, it's like that. On large bag day, it's like that. So it just gets more... It's a Chinese fan. It gets more and more like... Did you ever see uh, the big yellow man in uh, Sin City? Yes, that's what my the yellow bastard. Like on a fucking hot, on a... Sorry, sorry. That's what my bollocks are like on a, on a hot day. Like yellow man out of fucking Sin City. <laughs> anyway, um, what about uh, I'm still looking for these lyrics in case people think I'm rude because it's so rapey from LL here, and I just need to. You know, we need to complete that 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 thought. Yeah, I I, I always go. I I always enjoyed. Um, do you remember when uh, Kelly Rowland and Nelly? Yeah. Had their um dilemma. Dilemma. Oh, <laughs> mate. Yeah. Uh, what was that there again? The. <laughs> Yeah. I used to the lyrics of that song you. for so long where just, when I'm with my boobs. I thought she was saying when you lick my boobs. Oh, <laughs> when you lick my, my boobs. I was like, pretty sexual. Yeah. yeah. I love yeah. you ever seen the music video for it? Yeah. At the end they're dancing, the song just fades out, and then Kelly's ma comes out, and that's my favourite bit from a music video. Kelly! Kelly! <laughs> Get inside there! Kelly! <laughs> that's how the video ends. Do you know what I enjoy? Kelly! I unironically enjoy Neo. Oh, that oh, was great. See, uh, see every time that, uh, what do you call it, comes on? Closer? Yeah. Oh, mate. Turn the lights off in oh, this place. Like, do you know what I'm going to do? Lights off. Volume up, sir. <laughs> so I, you're sitting in your car in the dark. I see, yes. you. Outside the house. I've just, My balls are I've just, I've, just, <laughs> I've just smashed the streetlight. <laughs> knocked the headlights off. Miss Independent by Neil. What's another one? Oh, fucking... Miss Independent. That's a great song. What about yeah. that one? I'm so sick of love songs. That was nice too. <laughs> Why can I turn off the radio? Why can I turn off uh, the radio? Closer though. Turn the lights off. It is. Neil was good. The more you get, the more you want. Oh. Neil was, but Neil, Neil was a, like there's a lot of a lot of bangers off Neil. Yeah, like the modern day Neil, the closest to like who doesn't get the respect he deserves was banger after banger for more maybe younger people. Yeah, it's Jason Derulo. He's just bang 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 bang. Really, bang, bang, he was around the same time as Neil. Derulo. It's too hard to speak. Yeah. In my head, I see. What was the What was the Mario song? You should let me love you. Yeah. I was about to start singing the fucking Jack Black one from the movie there. <laughs> when you said the Mario song, I was being like, Peaches, Peaches, uh, Peaches, Peaches, Peaches. Give me a wee bit more of, of Mario. You should let me love you. Let me be the one to give you everything you want and need. Baby, good love and protection. A nine inch erection. Let me supersize you. <laughs> I like. Uh, let me supersize. <laughs> I said, let me circumcise you. Oh, I can supersize you. I thought, <laughs> uh, yeah, I um, 
I enjoy when when you rhyme, when you rhyme protection and affection. That's a good. Yeah. That's a good lyric. Like that is. Do you remember? If I remember the other Mario, Mario Win- Winnes. Mario Mario Wines. Is that how you said? Isn't it? Yeah. Can I can I jump back in? This Although Winnes sounds good. I found the lyrics. Um, LL Cool J in the song with it goes, "I'm battling desire. Lord help me douse this fire. This internal inferno hotter than a shot of Cuervo, or top of short purple." Quervo? Tequila. Uh-huh. Belly dancing sounds in a like circle. Qu- sorry, Quervo sounds like quads, Quar vodka. Yeah, but That's this Quervo. is Quervo. Oh, it's Quervo. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> She's belly dancing in a circle. When I feel like this, I can't resist. Stop it. Don't make me hurt you. All right, LL. All right. Stop it. Don't make me hurt yeah. you. And then he goes, Zuzu, 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 Don't make me hurt you. That's how he hurts her. With a fucking finger in the ribs. Zzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzz
Come, my lady. Come, oh, come, yeah. my lady. My, my tattoos butt. fly off. My yeah. shoulders, baby. <laughs> what a weird. I know someone who booked them for a show. In the OES Center? No. Because they were there like two years it ago. It was in a nightclub in Crazy Belfast. Yeah. Um, used to be Foundry. Oh, nice. What's Foundry? It's where Steph Gittin used to be. Mm-hmm. Do, you, do you know what is so sad now? I've discovered this. I'm in some places in Belfast. I'm two businesses ago. And yeah. I don't mean... I don't mean like oh what did that used to be yeah. I mean what did it used to used to be yeah, yeah. yeah. like like people are like oh stiff kitten I'm like where's that oh the Chicago pizza pie Chicago Factory. pizza Bingo. pie that's it yeah oh stiff kitten's yeah. way too old even for me like that was way before the stiff do you know what banging. someone said to me the other day where are you playing where, where was it? Where was that gig and I said the limelight and they go spring and air break and I went no, I hate when people say that limelight mm-hmm. you root <laughs> it was limelight before I never changed I always called it limelight no, Katie's never is dead, changed. isn't it? Well, Katie's dailies is gone. I know. Have you seen the new one though? Gone. It's nice. The, like new, the new bar is I've nice. I've heard there's a new performance space in there. Uh, it looks yeah. brilliant. Do nice. you know the only thing that is sad? So, well, sorry, mm-hmm. this isn't the thing that's sad. Somebody might be doing stuff in that way, performance space, but anyway. Um, that sounded here, very yeah. rapey. Here, here's yeah. <laughs> Zar Kelly. Yeah. Doing, doing <laughs> It's me. I'm 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 putting pictures of myself on the floor. <laughs> nice. It all makes one big picture <laughs> of me. <laughs> so it's it's um the the one thing that is sad about it is the floor is gone. I love mm. the floor in Kitty Tilly's. Yeah, I know that sounds floor. again like I go around fucking yeah. licking the floor. Yeah, and being we like, went in and there's just there's actually no floor. You just walk in. It's a giant pit. <laughs> yeah, you just fall straight <laughs> off, straight, straight to, to hell. Kelly. <laughs> it's just at the, at the bottom of it is like Skeletor <laughs> and Darth Maul <laughs> and, and Evil Smog. In. You know, <laughs> Evil and yeah. Oh, the um, man, don't get me just started. everyone who falls to their death yeah. in the movie. Hans Gruber. Yeah. <laughs> don't get me started in the Masters of the Universe. <laughs> oh, one of the greatest pieces of cinema. It's ever. so good. Oh mate, I love it. Do you know the, the real door? Ding 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 oh, ding ding ding. The big show. fucking let's the, do a the, watch along with the master. The, 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 the big light dildo. The key. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> do, do you know what's a great, a genuinely great eighties <laughs> theme of a movie? You know, like the the want you to say something a couple of times in a film that goes nail the theme, right? Yeah. yeah. A couple of times, but Gwildor absolutely nails it where he goes, "The universe is music." Kevin, yeah. <laughs> is there anything more eighties than that? Yeah. Oh, uh, Courtney the, Cox in an early role. I tell you what, she was great in it, but it was a, an early moment to me going, I like muscular physiques. Watching that film. See, whenever He Man was getting whipped, I was like, I like this physique. Why, why are you trying to wash him with a root? Oiled. He was <laughs> Dolph like, Lundgren. Yeah. I will never kneel to you. Yeah. Oh, so oh what well, a show. And Skeletor was, what's his, what, Frank Langella. Frank Langella. Oh, amazing. He's was. amazing in it. Yeah. He was better than he was in the box. He, does, he does this one. He goes out, kill them. Kill them all. Yeah, it's like, tremendous. See the way you said it remind the way you said have you ever seen the Mortal Kombat movie? It sounds very similar to that. It is a wee bit like that, but can yeah. I can I do one more line delivery from Frank yeah, Langella? So when he says to He Man, he goes, No and he whips him and, and goes, I went Bruh. and he goes, I will never kneel to you and he goes, Yes, yes you will, or your friends will not live to see another day. Yeah. That's the exact case. But you know what? I'm going to do that kids. next time I see the Pet Shop Boys live oh. just in the crowd. <laughs> Neil! <laughs> <laughs> but you know something? The 300 stole the whole premise. See, kicking down a big hole. Kicking down a big hole, yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. That's another <laughs> fucking yeah. at the bottom of it. The Persian emissary. Is the oh, what was his name? The big seven foot. Oh, Darius. Was it? Was Xerxes. Oh, Xerxes. 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 If you get a wee nose ring, you could do Xerxes. <laughs> I'm per- Porksies. I'm like fat version of Porksies. <laughs> you know what? I have a few clip on earrings downstairs. Don't ask why, but I have. I pop them on. <laughs> Don't <Over>. ask why. <laughs> um, I won't. Uh, give me, I, w- I want some stupid music video stuff here. What are we? What era are we talking? Like maybe like that, 15, we're, we're, 20 years ago though. That classic. I used to always love RB videos. Meant to be sad one that don't look at the camera. It's just that. Oh yeah. Yeah. The, the, All in my head. The emotional singing in the bedroom. Yeah. yeah. I can't yeah. go on. I'm loving you. Again. Uh, but see, with that time, I actually had a chat about it before in a podcast with Ishan Akbar. It was one of the funniest things ever because we were talking about that era of RB. It's like why do boy bands always want to? kill themselves it's like why is the breakup so bad they're like I need to die immediately yeah like there were male like, embarrassments but, see, but like, back in the day like our girls not going you're pathetic what way are you getting on fuck away off from my window with your fucking boom box yeah, and, all that and, shit. and then you realise that it's actually like some fucking weird country singers boning them yeah but you know, what, do you know why because <laughs> he's aloof but, but what Curtis was Staggers 
Ishan made a funny point. Yeah. He said he was growing up and at his time in life he was listening to that kind of like emotional boy band <coughs> music, but also Bollywood music. And he's like, the Bollywood music, he was like, those guys took it way worse. He goes, there's one Bollywood breakup song I listen to and the literal translation of the lyrics are, if you don't get back with me, I will drain my body of all its blood. I will climb to the top of a mountain and I will have no more blood in my body. She's like, that's how incel and desperate like, <laughs> Indian youth are listening. If to you don't get going, back with me, I'm going to yeah. raisin myself. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to slow slice myself yeah. forever. Isn't that that's fucking yeah. wild? I said, you got to do a bit about that. That's hilarious. Yeah. If you won't date me, I'll turn myself into a date. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Bollywood music. I'm, I'm, there was What was that one with the Pussycat Dolls? Oh, Je- Jai Ho. Yeah. That's a funny video where he just yeah. changes the background. Yeah. They were a weird group, weren't they? Jai Ho. They were literally I love everything the to me. I them. They oh, were buttons, mate. I, them. I was sexy. The, the, only, oh, buttons, the <laughs> only song that I would say I actually know of theirs is "Don't You Wish Your Girlfriend Was." And oh, it, on the it, video, it, it on the song, Buster Ryan says he wants to go till his dick's all black and bluish. He, here's another. <laughs> here's another here's, <laughs> that's a battered cock. Like, <laughs> he says that in that song. Gonna do my dick's all black and bluish. Yeah, literally. who says that? Which oh, is black Rams. and blue and Irish for yeah. him that doesn't speak. He, um, he, uh, <laughs> the, what do you call it? Um, oh, balls. I, do you know what's a weird one? Uh, you remember Dirty, Christina Aguilera? Yeah. Um, mm. I mean, that was like... Oh, the first music was, video where I was like, leave the room, mum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just watching pop videos. Yeah. I call them that because it makes me ass. pop. Fucking yeah. condensed milk all over my mugs. But um, <laughs> yeah, the, what do you call it? The, um, the, I'm the, making Bailey's in here. Get out, mum. <laughs> Making Billy. <laughs> oh my god! Speaking of, I need to tell you about my my new my drink. Can, can I tell you about dirty yeah, and then and then we'll get to this? Yeah, come, please. So um, that we were listening to that the other day. Came on the radio, and we were just both amazed. I actually, do, do you remember? Can you can do you remember the featuring act on that? On. Um, on oh, dirty. Dmx. No, Red, 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 Red Sorry, right? yeah. I love Redmo. I don't. Right, why? Uh, right, and here's why: the only two things I know him for Bring me along. are are fucking <laughs> on on dirty, and he also was on an Offspring song called Original Prankster, yes, did which did was did like did the did Offspring on bust down on it, and he goes Original, original Prankster, prankster. Yeah. break out yeah, Original yeah, yeah. right. Weird. So. Great video though. Funny video because mm-hmm. it's like there's actually a bit where a kid spreads shit on a piece of bread and gives it yeah. to somebody. And they eat it. Is that classic? And uh, that why, why did that shake? And he's literally going. <laughs> <laughs> it's brilliant. Those videos were weirder than R and B videos. R- pop, pop punk, punk videos. Yeah. There was yeah. always wrestling in them. Wrestling uh-huh. people like uh, like we we yeah. fucking like p- p- people in school. It's always in school. So, uh, someone yeah. who not even always a skater and maybe not Tony Hawk someone who was like an unlockable character in Tony Hawk. Yeah, yeah. Is in the background. Just like I'm supposed to fucking so, know somebody like that goes I guess in the video. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wee man from like, Jackass in every video. <laughs> well, always Wee man from Wee Jackass. Man and Preston, yeah. Always yeah. like. Yeah. Yeah. But um, tell you what, it's always an emotional roller coaster. The Youth of the Nation by POD. That's you won't believe this. Yeah. I was reading about POD the other day on my Wikipedia yeah. on, on my Wikipedia <laughs> because they came into my head. I woke up thinking about. You remember the what song that went? Um, what what put me on that? Not not Youth alive. of the Nation. I feel, feel so, so alive. alive. Yeah. That was in my head the other day. But it's a good song. And ironically, I was knackered. Do you know what so, he stands for? Pebble on Death or Correct. something? Correct. Yeah, Christian Rocks. Um, Christian Rock. Very weird. No. Anyway, I want to get back into a wee bit of this video stuff because mm. the reason why I was bringing up Dirty was just we were listening to that the other day going, Redman must literally live. Redman? Eddie Redman. Redman. Eddie he Redman. He must live. <laughs> he must live. Going to get dirty. <laughs> he must literally live. Raise the alarm. <laughs> woof, woof, woof. <laughs> <laughs> he, he must literally live on the... Uh, on the, the royalties of Dirty. Yeah. Because that's the most famous no, thing he's, he's done. He, he yeah. is a massive yeah. rapper. Like, no, no, he's not. Wu-Tang? No, he is. He's not. No, he's not Wu-Tang. He's, oh. he's not massive. In the rap world, well, he, no, that means groupies, he's not massive. I can't that means remember. he's in that. I ju- he has a lot of so. I want to find out. He was in a group. I can't like that's like going was. kill switch engage or massive. Yes, in in their genre. Yeah, but you they're not massive. You can still make a comfortable living. Yes, it's comfortable, but they're not. No, but they're not. They sell out. They're not Metallica though. No, do you know what I mean? Well, no, but that's like going, oh, you're not Taylor Swift, why bother? No, it's not saying why bother, it's saying he's like... He's Eminem's favourite rapper, Redmond. Really? I would say Killswitch probably made quite a lot of money off the Holy Diver cover. 
Death Squad. Yeah. Death Squad. Who kill switch? Yeah, I think yeah. that's probably their biggest earner. Yeah, that's a good as, as like a and also possibly this least, far. Yeah, yeah. yeah the they made, I think song. they yeah. make a lot of royalties just from this far, wrestling yeah. from it. And, and they had a couple in movies as well, <laughs> like the, the end of heartache and. But that the, the one, end of heartache was in Resident Evil. One of them movies. Would be great the Sherlock Holmes film. And do that face again. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, what was that one we liked the new the new one they did where the hard was back and the, the oh, was also for original uh, uh, it's the, hard the, the signal one. fire yeah the signal the fire, fire. the it's, signal fire yeah it's, cool. it's a great song if you want to out do some stuff oh, like work out signal fire or something I'm yeah. late, I'm late to check that out I don't good know tune <sighs> put gloves on put the oven gloves on when you fucking press play on that one made you put your fingers yeah oh. so also I, tell me then about this uh your cocktail. Oh, yes. I have a drink suggestion. I want to pitch it to the Dragon's Den if anyone wants to invest in this. It's a full thing. It's called Barman's Come, right? Now, we were on a stag do one time. It was the Redman's Come. Yeah, it was the Redman's Come. It'd be totally different. Yeah. It'd be kind of brown because of burst yeah. blood vessels, I'd assume, because all that fucking black. No, it's Busta. That's Busta. Yeah, Busta Nut. Busta yeah. Come. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, Busta Slimes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if he married Paul Natini. He'd be called Busta Natini. <laughs> 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 But so far as <laughs> <laughs> we we were a stag dude, and like the stag was blocked, and no, let me, let me take a few seconds to just enjoy how good that was. Imagine if he <laughs> married Paul and mm. That's brilliant. Grab my last request and just let me bone you. Um, but Ronnie side up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but we were on a stag dude, and the stag was looking to drink, and we had no drinks left. So we gave him a wee, just it was a candle, and we're like, he's like, what's this? And we're like, oh, barman's come, and, yeah, and he got it, and then afterwards, Why are you we, drinking we, he drank a candle. <laughs> so we needed, we needed, the end, come. we needed the formula barman's come for the next way. Barman's come. Tag. So now, <laughs> Hagrid, <laughs> we have, we have a, a drink called barman's come. What's in barman's come? Condensed milk, Bailey's Malibu. Right, and now you're oh. probably like gross, but oh. I don't think gross. Put it together, and how do you sell it? You make it a whole thing. You get the logo slogan. I've had barman's come. When you yeah, do it, you good. don't just drink barman's come. The barman gets up in the bar. He just shakes in your face. Yeah, yeah. Get as much of it in your mouth. Ah, Which for condensed milk, that's gonna be tricky. Yeah, but listen, it's barman's come, and then yeah. you get the photo. Shh, goes in the Polaroid. I've had barman's come on the T-shirt. You fuck it in the river, and it becomes our Kelly's. Face. I drank barman's come. That's <laughs> it. I've drank barman's come. I've gargled barman's come. I've swallowed yeah. barman's come. I've had barman's come. Barman's come. Dripping in yeah. barman's come. Boom. Listen, it's probably not a family episode. Can you can you speak to your cousin, Stephen, and get him to invest? <laughs> Stephen Bartlett. This reminds me of the time. This reminds me of the time when do you remember South African footballer Sean Bartlett? Have I talked about? Yes, this? I know. Or like in Charlton Athletic Legend. Yeah, yeah. Whenever I was at school, I told people. I think I have talked about this. <laughs> I told people he was related to me, and somebody went, "No, no they were all I bollocks Bartlett, and all." And it was a bit of a joke, and then somebody defended me and goes, yeah. "No, I've seen his dad, my dad. He's a bit swarthy, like." <laughs> I'm like, yeah, but he's not South African though, is he? Yeah, a bit anyway, swarthy. A bit swarthy. I love anyway. that. Uh, back to these music videos, mm. right? Do you, do you uh, just just on that sort of Blink One Two? They used yeah. to do a great video. Hey, yeah. hey, I'm going to see them. I'm going to see them. Can't wait. We're September. all going to see them. Are oh, you going? Nice. I'm going to try. We're oh, we well, too late. Too, too late. Have a have it. Yeah. When is it? Uh, 5th of September. September. Yeah, we. Ah, no, I'm not. Do you know what happened? Do you know what happened in here for No Blasters HQ? All right, Daddy decided mm. you're going because I I I I, 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 I shouted tickets for the whole time. I, I, I asked that's him; he nice. just never got back to me. But that's I right. think I probably told nice. you I was going, and did you want to go? And yeah. then you didn't say. I I absolutely did. Told you I wanted to go, but yeah. sorry, sorry. I just hope that's Kong. about the time you walked away <laughs> from me. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> likes you when you're 26. I just hope. Oh, Which I am. Speaking of music, like actually. Have you ever thought about the lyrics of the song Umbop by Hanson? They've done a remake of that Umbop, song with Busta. Have you heard that? Ba, do, ba, twist my nipples. Do you, ba, but do you know how, we're 13. But do you know how deep the lyrics are to that? Us, <laughs> do, you know how, do you know how deep the lyrics are to that? I, I don't know any lyrics. All I hear when I hear that song is... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All I hear is like, it's the late 90s and this Here's is a question. fucking everywhere. Here's a question. Yeah. Yeah. Is there a similarity between the vibe of that? Well, I, I just in singing that in the mm. <laughs> sounds exactly like 
on pretty by DLC or yeah. DLC uh, by DLC, yeah. DLC. <laughs> DLC. Yeah, DLC. <laughs> Downloadable content, yeah. Um, yeah, like uh, <laughs> but you know what? The ironic thing is, Hanson were sexier girls and TLC. <laughs> then I get back to me. Nah, TLC were hot as shit. Sorry, mm-hmm. there's there's a mental there's a mental music video on Pretty by TLC. Mm-hmm. A mental music video of uh, uh, it actually finishes with Chili from TLC kicking a guy in the face because he wants her to get bigger tits. That's what that video is. That's what that video is. He, he, Chili was the sort of harder <clears throat> one of them, the three, wasn't you? Yeah. The red haired one? No, no, that's T Bowls. Yeah. <laughs> so Chili. T Bowls! I knew that too yeah. quick, didn't I? I yeah. was a massive TLC fan. Really? And then Lisa was the other one that died. Lisa left Eye Lopez. Lopez. Died in the car crash, didn't you? Oh, Plane, do you remember here? Car- no, a car crash. The car? They actually have well, the, the footage the of the it. Car t- the car turned into the for a few seconds. Detail? Definitely don't put it on. Oh, well, uh, it's it's horrific. Sure. They have because yeah. it was being videed when she. Oh, it's horrendous. Anyway, so the she's the, um, on pretty after that. I'm sure. Yeah. No, you will need scrubs <laughs> yeah. on the on the road. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Showing from left eye in the wise left. Yeah. There's waterfalls of blood. <laughs> yes, down that road. <laughs> I, I You're gonna want some scrubs to clean up this <laughs> fucking dashboard. <laughs> <laughs> We're just doing it again, are we? Did you say that? I said that. I w- sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> I'm like, all right. Um, I was thinking of the left eye one when you spoke. Apologies. Uh, um, <laughs> I uh, <laughs> the, the, I was actually a, I I was actually quite a fan of theirs. I I do. I, I had yeah. I had their first albums, the the Waterfalls yeah. one. I can't remember what it was called. Crazy, sexy, cool. Yeah. And I also had um, Sex Magic. That was fan too, fan right? meal. Was the one. Oh, I thought you were going to say you've sent the family, which I would love to read it. I know, yeah. Here, T-Boss! Right. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's Big Bag Bartlett here. <laughs> yeah, will you ask Left Eye to see me? Anyway. Because uh, uh, you're rotten. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, so let me see. What is Chili stinking right now? No, no, no. She's okay. Oh, no, you're straight away. Is Chili the, the long-haired one? Yeah. yeah. Oh, she's the hottest? Yeah. No. Chili. Anyway. I'm from... The none of them are hot. Anyway, yes, not, not yeah, now. Anyway, so... <laughs> Shut up. Says me. Shut, yeah, shut says, the fuck says up. Says judge and jury, Karen Bartlett. You know what I mean? No, no. What a long night. I mean this with respect, but Chili nowadays looks like Mo Farah a bit. I don't, I'm not for that. Christ. Yeah. Anyway, the, the what do you call it? She uh, was the sexy one back the, in the day. Do you remember, but the kick she does at the end of the video is so shit because you, you, in order for it to work, you would need her foot to finish out of the shot. So it looks like she's kicking this guy off the shot, but you actually see her foot. Only you would mm. watch a no, it looks TL, like a TLC video and be like, that kick's not very realistic. See, see this bit? This is, Michael, I'll never do this again. I'll never say this is a clip. I will. But mm. this is a clip. Get the kick of her because it's shit. It's so shit. Anyway. And, and T-Boz, she like does she's like a bonfire, doesn't she? <laughs> That's mad. She yeah. doesn't, she, she, she looks like she's had a fucking hard paper round. Like, yeah. And she looks like the poodle left eye from the wreck. Like, fuck me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know what? Left eye was actually probably the cutest. She looks like one of those wee here's, Japanese cartoons. Here's two know? absolute bangers involving left eye Lopez. Don't know why I had to know. reject myself there, but I did, right? Have <laughs> you is, is is got a is that semi right Style now? of the kick? No, no, it's way worse. Anyway, She's here's... Just ripping one out there. Here's, I know, yeah, here's the, here's the thing, right? She, Lisa left eye Lopez was involved in that song... Just call Lisa. Lisa. Le- left eye, He's left well, eye. Yeah. Be the same, same again. again. Yeah. Yeah. The rap was weird though. That's her bit of it. I know, but it was weird. But that whole song was Come weird. Come out like a new moon rise. No, no. I like that bit. Oh, it was so yeah. weird to me. It, it, it felt uh, like not in the rhythm of the song. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then she was also involved in, and I had the single of this, an absolute banger. Danelle Jones, you know what's up. Ooh, say what, say what, say oh, what? Good bang, you yeah. know that I like it, baby. I would not Girl, have known that know until he sang up. it. And you know what I need? Oh, banger! To ejaculate it most of the time. Me and my those people guys, be rolling. What? <laughs> That's all those guys need. Just those rap songs. They, they, they all. They yeah. all. Yeah. You know what I need, girl. Yeah. Spunk. To <laughs> jizz. Oh, we, oh, we, oh, we fucking. I'm busting. I, I, need, I need a wee busting. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna break one off here. Like, I'll what does that one mean? Yeah, Cum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they can't just say I want a spunk. I have to live with different terms. Hi, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to talk to you. No. 
You know what's up. It's my dick. Yeah. You know what I need. It's punk. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, a lot of the, a lot of those songs from that time. Need and spunk. Like your neighbor comes around with a wee cup. Need and spunk. Yeah. Like, we have not. <laughs> we I keep spunk. needing. Keep, keep needing, needing spunk. <laughs> uh, let's, uh, let's do the champion. This is what we're all here for. The crisp Champions League final. <laughs> Oh. Like of crisps. Is there it's a cold tato, beer kicking about you, Billy? Can it's tato cheese and onion versus oh, oh no no. What tato cheese and onion there? versus Walker's Max Strong chicken hot wings. It's a fucking. Thank you, darling. Me and Dave are on this podcast. Oh no. Oh, I've got it. No, William. No. Have you, are they your milk teeth or are they your adult teeth? Wait a minute, they're my milk teeth. Fuck me. Do you only get one set? You're not a really shark, bro. Have a nice wee set on me. Um, I'm trying to think of other great songs from that time that I enjoyed. This also, is how we do it. Also, the... Um, it's Friday night. <laughs> you know, I feel all right. I enjoyed... I need I, to bust nuts on the west side. Do you remember the so five... I reach from a 40. <laughs> do you remember the five song... Uh, do, 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 yeah. do, I woke up today with, with this boner. feeling. Yeah, <laughs> woke up today with this feeling. I need to throw a load up your back. Um, yeah. What's a great song from that time? Starlight. 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 Can, Can you, you hear me? me? Do you know what I enjoy? That's a song? weirdest fuck music video. Here's an even weirder one. Do you remember the one uh, for uh, Ooh, baby? I feel right. Music sounds better with you. Is that just a guy with a wee artificial airplane? <laughs> he, just, built, he builds yeah. a model airplane and throws it at the end of the video. And you're like, I know, what was your man who's married to Vanessa Feltz? What was his song? Oh. And a similar one. Got to turn yeah. around. Yeah. Hey, what's yeah. wrong with you? Yeah. I'm wearing a glittery coat. Hey, what's uh, wrong with you? I'm bucking Vanessa yeah. Feltz. Uh, <laughs> He's like, just turn around <laughs> and put one of those yeah. shoes. Got to turn around. So don't see your fucking face, Vanessa. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Fair play. Now, I thought they break up pretty early. You know? Yeah, she's uh, Vanessa she, needs to felt this. Not doesn't work. No. <laughs> Vanessa Felch. Um, oh. Yeah, she's oh. she's she's not, <laughs> she's not great. Um, yeah. I'm gonna need more like beer for that. I, 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 I don't I like tell that. you that Vanessa felt so I need to be at least four deep <laughs> four inches um, she's horrific what about um, would you rather Vanessa felt or left eye after the crash what would you rather oh, <laughs> my. oh my god let's crisps it's crisps champions league unbelievable how don't do the cool J lick after that how, no, how soon are we talking don't get <laughs> Still warm. Okay, yeah, left. Like, so, like, so. Still alive, still with a pulse. Like, yes. I would like, to, if she's got the pulse, and then after I pull out, Alec Reed comes in and gives her a right, that's, that's fine. What has happened here? That's fine. Tato. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, what's your favourite crisp? So you are going to try Oh, no, no, no. First. That's bad luck. What? Bad luck to open a bag crisp it's upside down. bad luck to open a bag crisp upside down. <laughs> Talking about a dead woman <laughs> and how warm she needs to be when you buck her ground. <laughs> no, no karma for that. No, no. Um, so you just try the potato cheese and onion. I'm going to try these. Can I ask a personal and private question? Where did the uh, chili ones go out? The Max Strong? Because they were unbelievable. They tasted like jalap- jalapeno. Oh, they went out to these with Kev oh. and Jared McCabe. Oh. No, oh, uh, Jared McCabe has a, has a dirty girl school, doesn't he? Do you know that? He was that what that said was on a podcast one his dream is to run a school a school of bad girls that he has the discipline there's me in but what the fuck are you talking about Jeremy <laughs> Cave. like do you have one wish in the world he's like I want to run a school for bad girls I was like I like that Jared when did he say that on a podcast with me and Diona what the fuck yeah. are you there's a clip saying? there's a clip it's and a lot of and I've polluted my podcast yeah. I just I <laughs> speaking of I it. need need and it, uh, again the slogan perfect with beer hmm Perfect yep. with beer. What would our product be that goes perfect with Barman's comments? I want to know. Ch- cheese Fucking cake. hot oxters. <laughs> yeah. Um. I'm sad the jalapeno cheese didn't get a look at. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, so was I. I would have put. Well, you run this competition? No, no. Competition is fur. Right. Mm. Yes, has a look in, and we did a score for that, and they won. Oh really? Yeah. Because I th- like they're nice, but I do think jalapeno cheese is the best of those. I'm gonna say. This is fucking. These are coming up though. Excuse me. They're nice, and that does t- taste like my my childhood. That tastes like an actual roast chicken. They, oh. The warp. Oh. Wait, wait. Mm. 
perfectly I've, clear. I've said this mm-hmm. once. I'll say it again. These taste like chicken cooked on the bone. Mm-hmm. So you have They're to so give them... They're so sexually tasting chicken ha- cooked on my bone. You have, mm. to, you have to give them that. However, let me also say this. Putting the cock in spatula. See, mm. Tato. And, and here, some people think this is bullshit. See, Tato, at this time of year, when they're frying them new potatoes... And they are at the minute. I can tell. There's a wee fella who's How can you tell? It's the roadside, Bally, Bally look Castle. How, look, how, look at the colour of them. Yep. That's a new potato. Right. Oh. You can tell by the colour. They're fresh. They're fresher. There's no. There's no wee dirty bits in there. Grand fresher. They are unbelievable. <laughs> they are unbelievable. Right now. Fucking choke on that. Fucking come. Um. So I I'm gonna. Uh, Okay. I'm gonna. Can we vote? Can we vote back? Well, here's a couple of things to take into account. I'm hammered. The thing about uh-huh. potato down, I think, is the waveform, as in, if you were eating these and then going on a night out, that's a breath issue, right? You should be eating crisps for a night out. You've been on a party, someone brings in crisps, you have a few. Let me lift us both out of this room. To the crash side of Lisa, no, <laughs> in <laughs> into a public house, right? We're in the bar, and you go up the bar. <laughs> no, the crash side. <laughs> so we're in a bar. Daddy goes up to the bar, he comes back, a couple of beers. He throws down a pack of these, and he throws down a pack of these. What wins in that environment? I think Tato every day. Mm. I mean. Mm-hmm. I don't like chicken flavored crisps. The so thing, I, I'm I'm biased. The thing that lets us down for me is the cost. Two twenty five mm-hmm. for a bag of them. Can I also and these say we're free mm-hmm. because I'm friends with Tato. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? Sorry, the 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 Walker's Max Strong are two twenty five a bag. Can I make a, a comment on the the Max Strong chicken? I honestly believe I I I would give it to Tato on this ground. But I don't believe that the chicken, hot chicken wings, is the, is the Max nicest Strong. Max Strong. Yeah. I believe that jalapeno and cheese. I, yeah. Okay. I agree. The yeah. I agree. Yeah. So, let's just, let's all put a score of them. If this was a football match, yeah. what do you think the score would be? I'd, and we'll add that up and that'll and then average it, and that'll be the score. Okay. And that's how we decide. Yeah, that's a much more simple system than what's your favourite. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> You're such a wee fuck. What's my, what's my scoring technique? Crisp, right. No, I'd say uh, this is a right, problem. I have my score. I don't think a lot of people talk about. Sneak eating's a thing. You know, you sneak away, you, have, you mm. eat some and they're quick, and, you yeah. ha- and then you... I would sneak eat these. I don't think I could sneak eat those. I would go and I'd whop a wee bag of these in me, no bother. I would go out and I'd be sweating too much after those come in. What would you be doing? None. I know, I'm going through a bad time when I can't sneak eat them. Uh-huh. Like I'll buy them in the shop uh-huh. and then eat them in the car on the way home. I think these are like Man City and they're like Man United. You know what? Sorry, the Max Strong, Man City, as in billions though. And <laughs> here, they won the treble by by cheating. Damn, 115 on. counts oh, of cheating. Can, can I have a look at that real quick? And if this is Man City, let yeah. me just look. I've always wanted to see inside Man City. Oh, what? <laughs> no soul. There you go. <laughs> Means nothing. Bought all the money in the world thrown behind that, all the PR. Yeah. Tato, and you know, and these are respect. Arsenal. Oh, look, no trophies. <laughs> 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 Who do you support, mate? That's right, no Europe, fuck up. Northern Ireland. Right. Um, <laughs> still applies. Still no Europe. <laughs> you know what? Can you do this? And again, I think people would judge it. Oh, let's, let's do this. I don't know. Here. We'll cheers it. Hang on. Sponsor <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Cheers. Sponsor me, Shara. Oh. You know what the sad thing is? I absolutely could have done that. British long distance oh. running legend, Mo Chara. Drinking the end of a bag of potatoes. Here. <coughs> and here, you know another factor I would add to my score? Tieable bags. Do you know the way, you know the way in like some movies, someone will just want, like, who's dying? There's like, give me a last smoke mm-hmm. for that. Mine would be like, just give me one last wee drink of potato. Do you reckon that's what Lisa left? I was saying, give me one more dick. <laughs> get your, get your. <laughs> light it for me. <laughs> get your scores into your phones. Mine's already in. Alright, have you got okay. cash? I'll pop it in here, hold on. And then do we hand you the phone and you read the scores no, out? No, you can just read it. I'll trust you to read. Are you sure? You can just yeah. read it. I can't do the title, I think. I think you I can't be great <laughs> yeah. if you read it. Yeah, sure. I think yeah. you I, sure. I actually can't do it, dude. I'll, um, I'll do it. I've got a 
See what you did? You gave yourself shorter length. You need to go that way. Aha. You need to give it more length, you see. So, right, you, do you want to show your score? I'll show my score first, will I? Show it to Karen? Yeah. All right, yeah. I'm going for that. Yeah. Right? <clears throat> I'd say this would be my score. <laughs> A big one, Dave, Dave showed me an actual score, the way mine is. William showed me a black guy <laughs> packing heat. <laughs> packing cereal. That's my so grandfather. You show respect. Mm -hmm. That's my score. Right. Well, it's the fact I hit you with that video, that photo mm -hmm. most days. What yeah. was yours again? 3 1 Tato. Uh, mm -hmm. Dave's was 3 1 to Tato. Mine was 2 1 to Tato. William's was 2 0 to Tato. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. I mean, that's a fairly convincing. What is the average then? Like, well, the aggregate scores what? 2-0, 3-1. Isn't yeah. that 2-0, something like that? Oh, yours was 2-1, 2-0, 3-0, so 7. 8-2 eight, eight overall. Divide 8 by 3 and you get 2.5. Mm -hmm. Divide 2 by 3 and you get a third, so 2-0. My yeah. head hurts. It's 2-0 to Tato. Win. Tato wins the final 2-0. But listen, it's like when Inter Milan steamrollered fucking Bayern Munich. Sorry. But... <clears throat> Respect to Mark Strong. They are they're decent finalists. You know they're they're fucking they're good finalists. You know they're like they're it's like Liverpool AC. Oh no, oh, oh no, oh, sorry, oh. guys. Um, <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the Tato winning. <laughs> it's a great moment for Tato. It's Sounds like the actual time is it? <laughs> Jack Grealish boss oh. oh there's a man I love in the podcast right now Jack mm. Grealish mm -hmm. yeah because right he's out of his fucking mind we did an interview after they won the league and they're like we have a drink tonight Jack and he was like oh I <laughs> like, but you still wearing his kit I don't give a fuck oh sorry about that <laughs> I told you I've been reading that Anthony Keynes book haven't I yeah it's a mental book uh, I, issue. yeah it's a no lead singer Red Hot Chili Peppers. I got his autobiography. Do not ever disrespect me in a public it's more forum for the, it's more like for the, that. It's for the listeners. You I know who Antoine Cadiz is. You were just a channel for that. Here, can we just, while we're talking about Red Hot Chili Peppers, remind people, because he hates it, how much Aaron Butler looks like Flea? Thank you. Yes, no worries. Here we go. Aaron, Aaron Butler, Butler looks, looks like, like Flea. Flea. Does he hate that? Oh, Harry yeah. Potter? Aaron Butler. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said how much Harry Potter looks like Flea. I'm like, no, he doesn't. Nah. Yeah, what movie where Harry Potter has his cock yeah. out the whole That's time? harsh because Flea's a fucking. Flea's had a hard paper around. Like, but listen, Flea's got a big wab. So every cloud. But that has nothing to do with Have his you not face. seen when he did Woodstock 99? He just played a full set with his cock out? No. I, like, can, you, can you get it up? You look up Chili Peppers, like? Woodstock 99. The first image you see is Flea helicopter. Oh my god. But I mean, listen. If you got a Walt, my if I was doing that so on a stage, I would look like you know but that, the thing that stops the door from hitting the wall. Wow! Yeah, it'd yeah. be me. What I love about that book, though, is how he goes from like quite bizarre spiritu spirituality to how how much drugs he was using. So he'd be like, "I just believe we're all spirits, and your parents are the spirits that were meant to capture your essence." And then I, I was shooting heroin straight into my cock. <laughs> yeah. And he just jumps between the two. Yeah, it's mental. I just think love is love and everyone should his just get along together. His experiences were like his dad's. Anyway, I was no, banging no. my, ma, so my mean, dad's girlfriend. What does he mean by love is love? He would just say, he goes off on these weird tangents. Yeah, it's Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve, all right? No, he's just, like, he's just like, love is an energy that everyone siphons off of the earth and we tr truly have to respect the earth. I'm not ready for this to be close. And I was giving my dad's girlfriend doggy style in the hotel room bed and you're like, this is... Mental. He's definitely somebody that's grown up too quick because he was doing fairly hard drugs when he was yeah, a yeah. teenager. I was at least 16 before my dad asked me to fuck his girlfriend. Like, what age was he in that? 12 when his dad's like, do you want a buck? Yeah. The girl he, I'm seeing? In fairness to him, I was the same. I lost my virginity in a room with my dad as well. Yeah? Is that when you well, found out about Barman's come? But there was no other people in the room. <laughs> 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 now my dad didn't buck me, I bucked him. Just <laughs> <laughs> imagine you. <laughs> Happy birthday, daddy. Son is what you want, baby girl. I'm what you have. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me hurt you. <laughs> <laughs> my poor father, I'm sorry. What um, What's your favourite sort of song struck band from, say, 2000 to 2010? Oh, oh, Tom Jones, no, um, probably Corn. 
Corn, I love really? that shit. Yeah, they were my favorite band when I was like feeling uh, like thing. a freak on a leash all day. I dream about fucking. Yeah, <laughs> strange band. Well, yeah. Kings of Leon would have to be up there. Really, for, just oh. for that only by the night. Be album. older, please. What they're like? I, I was like already Kings of Leon. Married been this. since my fucking nah. 03. Do you know uh, there's a girl I used to work with? Nah, 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 that's an old song. She was on the stand line with this band years ago. Years ago, on the stand line, this band had photos with them and all. Be like, this wee band I was having drinks with them, they really sound. Kings Leon, before they were famous. You did? You know, this girl I went to right. work with. And you know when he had the really shit hair? Yeah, I was yeah. like, ah, his ears are poking out now. Yeah. Nah, 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 and then he nah, cut nah, it nah. and fucking wide ons everywhere. Sexy yeah. bastard. But for God, she's out of It's going to be Oasis for me. Even well, I mean, to be, to be fair, the first time Kings Leon were out, they looked like the Shackle Butchers. But anyway, um, mm-hmm. <laughs> what about. <laughs> I nearly said big shout out. I didn't mean that. Uh, what about. Um, <laughs> you nearly said what? Big shout out. And then realized. <laughs> Entirely Bye, not. Shout out to the Chuck and Butcher Massive. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> what about um Westwood baby? I, I love I love the Red Hot Chili Peppers in that era, like massively. But um I would Californication say album. Was Californication was like what, ninety nine? But like yeah. that like Arcadium. that mm-hmm. by the way, Stadium Arcadium. Uh-huh. A lot of people don't like Stadium Arcadium. Stadium. I do. Because uh-huh. they say it is like oh they went really quite poppy and then went, I was and like, there's I, too I, much. Too much on it is a there, thing it's a say. long I would long say long I think I think out of both those CDs, there's one class album in it. Mm-hmm. And they should have just been more editorial. What was their song like boom 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 Oh, Wet yeah. Sand is probably my favourite song out of all of them Even the first three minutes are okay But see when it just hits that You don't fall, fall me in the wet sand You, you don't, don't fall me in the no. Oh it's a fucking banger me in the wet sand Where would they I like? do Dost as well That's an unreal Dost that's an What about Oh do you know one of my favourite ones is Hey Bloom 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 Arcadium still, yeah. 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 <laughs> is an F on Stadium Arcadium? Yes. That's a good calm down song. <laughs> if you're out a wee bit heavy, you're hungover. Yeah. F, it's just like. <laughs> Isn't that it? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to this acapella yeah, version yeah. of No Blasters. <laughs> why? Why what was that? Was it in the bus? No, what was it? That we should have been on. That that you should do. It's not Buzz Cox. Never mind the Buzz Cox. It is. Yeah, Buzz Cox. Yeah. Cox yeah. yeah. If, if yeah. the Chili's ever came up on that, we're nailing it. Like, oh, hundred yeah. percent. Yeah. Where do they rank in terms of your favorite bands ever? Top five. Easy. The, top I, would, five. I would probably have to throw them in the top five. Yeah. Um, who are we talking? <laughs> I, I for me like, for a man from West Belfast, would you say that the police are quite high on your list? Yes. Yes, I would say Ironical. that. Um, I love. Do you know what I actually love? I love Sting. So. Mm-hmm. I'll, I'll, I would have to include the police in that, if you know yeah, what I mean. Yeah. Um, I would have Kill Switch in there for sure. They're a band that I listen to all the time. Mm. Red Hot Chili Peppers. John Martin has to probably go in there for me. And then it probably fluctuates. Then the, the last, the, mm-hmm. the last fifth is probably like either say. Iron Maiden or Metallica. Yeah, well, you Metallica know. are hard to beat, aren't mm. they? What about, I need to bring this band up, what about Limp Bizkit? They get a lot of shit, because but they have... Because they are quite... They have mm, some of the greatest know, songs. I don't love them. Some of the best songs ever. Made My Way. Good yeah. song. Break Good stuff. Song. What about what about Fastlane? Yeah. Cool life in the fast like the lane. Minute, I'm not 15. And I'm a crazy yeah. motherfucker. Living yeah. it up, but not DJ Lethal, bring it on. In the fast lane. <sighs> don't, 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 they're, they're, I love the music. Fred Durst fucks me off, man. What about, what about Rearrange? Yeah. Another weird video where they all get put into a gas chamber and milk drowns them. Yeah. 
But is that boiler? Or is that another one? Like no, that? that's that's rearranged. Rearranged, yeah. Yeah, because he wore the. Do you know what? Mm-hmm. He wore a black that's Yankees right, hat, that. and I had that and mm-hmm. thought that I wasn't one of the sheep, but I was. Yeah, I was the biggest sheep, the black <laughs> yeah. sheep, if you will. But that was always something that I wanted in my life was a red Yankees hat, and I got one eventually when I was like thirty. I got, I got, I, I got. It. See the black one. Uh huh. I felt invincible in that yeah. hat, and I wasn't. Because it was rare. Was you look like a school shooter. I was a hat. rare wee teenager. You don't annoy me as someone from Northern Ireland. See the line, he goes, hey kid, take my advice. He should have said, you don't want to step into a big pile of shite. But he said shit. I yeah. was like, say shite, fucking rhymes. I know, yeah, say shite. Fuck Do you know what's an under, like, would be a top five band for me? Easy. Bloodhound Gang. Top five ever. I ever. fucking love. Show I think they're good on their love. Five. Love you know what my, my favorite song of theirs is Foxtrot Uniform Charlie Kill. Oh, I love that. <laughs> top five. No, they're no. fucking. I I think they're so funny. Kiss I me where it smells funny. Yeah. Bottle of the Chase Chase Elaine. Yeah. Just wanted to ask, could I eat your ass right back as soon as you can? Where came from? You had a lot of dick. Had a lot of dick. I've had a lot of time. Had a lot of time. You've had a lot. Of dick Left chasey, eye, but you ain't have mine. Mine. <laughs> 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 They have a lot of fucking great songs. Did you ever hear the va- the Vandals were sort of at it that time? Did you you know who I could see? Did you ever hear their it? song? My girlfriend's dead. Speaking of, which, I <laughs> once had a girlfriend. Then one day she left me. People always asking me where she was. They go, do 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 do. I don't want to <laughs> talk about her. People always ask about her, so I tell them all. My girlfriend's dead. Da, 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 I've never heard of But you know who, you know who I can see you like liking with your emo hair and your regal fingerless gloves and looking out a window. See if this is accurate, I will be sick. Incubus. I love them. I <laughs> man, I love them. What's yeah. it, what's Incubus? What's an Incubus? Uh, I wish you drive. were here. Drive. You see looking out the window. Lately I'm beginning to find that I should be the one yes. Yes. behind yeah. the wheel. This is Don't a thing on TikTok. Me. This brand of music, like this genre, is now known as divorced dad rock. It oh, is wow. dad rock. It's dad rock. No, it's divorced, divorced dad, dad rock. rock. Do you speak in which? I don't know it's where like, I saw this. Was it on Twitter or TikTok? It was a guy dressed as an emo Native American Indian singing Mumford and Sons on a picnic table. No, Have yes, you seen yes. that? Seen I, need, I need to find it. I don't yeah. know where it was. It's not your fault, but mine. That guy? Yeah. yeah. You're his, what, would, what, would, what would his Native American name be? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Chief, don't come to school tomorrow. <laughs> right. <laughs> Let me think. Uh, Chief bleeding wrists. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> Geronimo. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. We have to wrap this, guys, because we're, we're... Oh, shit, we're out of time? We're, we're shit out of time, bro. That's funny. Oh, why is that I type that in and that's what comes up? Like, what's going on? Don't know, but Sam, man. Full um, sexing. So, on Twitter. thanks for coming in for this episode. It's been fucking great. We have decided that the Chris Champions League winners are Tato, Cheese, and Onion. The boys have had a few beers. I've remained sober. Um, no, but that's just full barman's coming. Yeah, it's that just that's, that's a wee bottle of fucking vodka there. A wee bottle of <laughs> barman's, bar- bar- barman's spit. And, um, oh. yeah, so it's been a lot of crack. Thanks for joining us on this episode. Anything you just want to plug before we go? Yes, my I'm doing a show on the nineteenth of August in the Wall Garden. It's nearly sold out, so if in, you want to come, in Bangor by the Sea, I'll be there. It'll be a whole show about my love of TLC. So if you want to come to that, um, you can get there. Um, Ulster Hall and the Edinburgh Fringe tickets are flying out for the Ulster Hall and Edinburgh Friends. I don't know how they're doing, but come see me. Scotland. Um, I'm also doing the Fringe. I'm doing the SSC in November. Buy tickets. The Fringe. Talk about the Fringe a wee minute, will we? Can't even. We don't have time. No? Okay. No. All right. That's I'm great from that. Yeah. No. Please. No. <laughs> Please uh, thanks very much for joining us. We'll talk about the fringe another time. Okay. Uh, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much. Bye. Hope I don't. Have- oh, no.